All right, let's settle it once and for all, cold showers versus hot showers. We're diving deep into the age-old debate exploring the science and the sensations behind each. The ultimate question, which one's actually healthier? Which temperature truly reigns supreme when it comes to well-being? If you've ever stood outside your shower for 5 minutes, maybe even 10, just debating which temperature to pick, paralyzed by the possibilities, this video's for you. We're about to unravel the mysteries of shower temperatures. First up, cold showers. Let's brace ourselves for the chill. I won't lie, stepping into icy water isn't exactly fun at first. It's a shock to the system. A jolt that can take your breath away. But here's what happens. Your heart rate jumps, your breathing gets faster, becoming deep and rapid, and your body goes, wait, what's happening? This is an emergency. That shock actually wakes you up and boosts alertness. It's like a natural cup of coffee without the jitters. Some people swear by cold showers for increased energy, claiming it sets them up for a productive day and even a better mood thanks to a rush of endorphins, those feel-good chemicals your brain releases. Plus, there's some evidence that regular cold exposure can help reduce muscle soreness and inflammation, making it a favorite among athletes. Athletes use ice baths for a reason, right? It's all about that recovery. There's also a tiny metabolic boost, since your body works harder to warm up, burning a few extra calories in the process. But let's not freeze out the hot shower fans. Hot showers are like a warm hug, enveloping you in comfort. They help your muscles relax, which can be perfect after a long day or a tough workout, melting away the tension. The steam helps open up your airways and pores, providing relief and promoting clearer skin, which is great if you're feeling stuffy or just want clearer skin. It's like a mini spa treatment in your own bathroom. And honestly, nothing beats the comfort of a hot shower when you're stressed or tired. It's a simple pleasure that can make a world of difference. So, which is healthier? The truth is, it depends on what you need and what your body is craving. Cold showers can boost your energy, wake you up, making you feel invigorated and ready to tackle the day, and maybe even improve your immune system over time, although more research is still needed in this area. Hot showers can help you unwind, ease tension and soothe aches, providing a sense of calm and relaxation. If you have certain health conditions like heart problems, you'll want to check with your doctor before diving into cold showers. It's always best to err on the side of caution. And if your skin dries out easily, super hot water might not be your friend either. It can strip away essential oils, leaving your skin feeling tight and itchy. Here's a pro tip, a little trick to get the best of both worlds. Try finishing your regular shower with 30 seconds of cold water. Just a quick blast to invigorate you. It's a simple way to get the benefits without committing to the full polar bear experience. A gentle introduction to the world of cold therapy. Or switch up your shower based on your mood. A warm rinse one day, a cool blast the next. Listen to your body and give it what it needs. It doesn't have to be all or nothing. Find a balance that works for you. At the end of the day, both cold and hot showers have their perks. They offer unique benefits that can enhance your well-being. The healthiest choice is the one that fits your lifestyle and makes you feel good. The one you actually enjoy and can stick with. So next time you're standing there, hand on the faucet. Just remember, it's not about picking sides in some heated battle. It's about picking what works for you, tailoring your shower experience to your individual needs. Try both. Experiment. See how you feel. And maybe, just maybe, you'll actually look forward to that daily shower debate, embracing the possibilities.